What's going on with my beautiful Libras? How are my fellow moon signs doing? It's your girl Miss Hawaii here coming at ya. And you know what I'm here to give you? Your love reading. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's going on with my Libra. All right, how y'all feeling in love? What's going on? Libras. I'm using the Tarot Illuminati. All right. Show me my Libras. How are my Libras currently feeling in love? Libras. Show me how my Libras are currently feeling in love. Libras. How are my Libra people currently feeling in love? Ooh, seven of wands. Okay. Stand in your guard, protective. Stand up for yourself. Fighting back. All right. That's Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Show me how else my Libras are feeling in love, please. How else are my Libras feeling in love? <laughs> how else are my Libras feeling in love? Mm, the world card. Okay. Closure. Ending something. Okay. Feeling complete. I like that. How else are my Libras feeling? Ooh, I like this energy. How are some of my Libras feeling in love? The strength card in reverse. Uh-oh. That's Leo right there. Leo card. How are some of my Libras feeling in love? Why are you feeling like you ain't got no strength? You don't need courage. What happened? Why are you no strength? How are some of my Libras feeling? Mm, the Knight of Wands in reverse. Not taking action on something. That could be somebody you're dealing with. A Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I mean, uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Then you got the Eight of Cups. You're walking away from something. Eight of Pentacles. Building towards something. And the Page of Wands in reverse. Knowing you have to make a change, but not making it as of yet. With the Three of Pentacles. Not coming together in the bottom of the deck. Okay. You could definitely be dealing with a fire sign, okay? Um, let's see how your person is feeling. So what's the person that's dealing with the Prince of Swords? So that's the Knight of Swords. Could be dealing with the Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. So this, this is a change coming in. This person is coming in to make a change. Um, moving pretty quickly. King of Swords, okay. Coming to talk, want to clarify some things. Somebody in charge, could be somebody that's involved in the legal system. Ace of Wands, somebody wanting a new beginning, fiery, passionate beginning with you. Okay, how else is this person feeling? They're dealing with uh, Libra. Mm. This is a crazy Libra. Gemini, the Emperor in reverse. That's Aries and the Four of Swords. What is this? The seven of cups trying to make a decision. Somebody's meditating, contemplating, healing right now, not making no moves because they're trying to make a decision. Hmm. Ace of cups at the bottom of the deck. So that's new love right there coming in. Hmm. Let's clarify some of these cards, Libra. Show me the Eight of Cups, please, for Libra. Why is the Eight of Cups here? The King of Cups. You're walking away from somebody. Walking away from somebody could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio because of something they did. It's, you feel like it's the fair thing. Justice card. That's Libra energy. That's your card right there. Show me the Eight of Pentacles. Something that they did that you feel wasn't right. That's why you walk away. You're like, fuck them. 
Give me the Eight of Pentacles. Somebody that you did have love for, though, that had love for you. Six of Cups. It's somebody from your past you've been thinking about, trying to put effort and work in. Show me this Princess of Wands in reverse. Show me the Page of Wands in reverse. Show me the Page of Wands in reverse. Show me the Princess of Wands in reverse, please. Whoa! Talk about a splash of fucking energy. <laughs> Show me this Princess of Wands, please, in reverse. Show me the Princess of Wands in reverse. Okay. There we go. The Ten of Wands. It's been a whole fucking load for you. Stressful burden for you. But again, end of a cycle. Completing a cycle. I think with that person, whatever that Page of Wands is, it's over. Show me this uh, Prince of Wands. Show me the Prince of Wands in reverse. The Ace of Cups in reverse. Yeah, whoever this wand, this fire sign, you over it. That's over with. Okay, you've given your cup of love to yourself now. Show me the Strength card in reverse. The Strength card in reverse. <laughs> Four of Cups in reverse, discontent, Ten of Cups, Eight of Swords. Some type of woo, trouble in the home, on disharmony in the, with the family, in the home life. Could be family meddling in the relationship, something like that. Four of Cups, now kind of knowing more what you want, um, not being discontent anymore. Um, Eight of Swords is freedom, release. Okay, show me the, oh, that was quick, I need to say it. The Nine of Wands for the world. Okay, so that's you on top of the world card. That's you being guarded, um, trying to decide if you should stay, you should go higher front and reverse. Could definitely be some separation here with somebody. That's Taurus energy. Show me the seven of wands, please. Ooh, the world in reverse. Okay, wow. You were feeling, you did have a lack of closure before. Show me this Prince of Swords. Four of Wands in reverse. Hmm. Okay, so this person is either coming out type of broke up with somebody from before, or this person. Hmm, hold on. Seven of Wands in reverse. Who is this? You got this Knight of Swords with the Four of Wands in reverse. So that's somebody either somebody broke off an engagement, somebody broke up with somebody or ended something or some type of disharmony in the home again. Seven of Wands, this person is not really putting much effort into it. Show me the King of Swords. The Six of Swords in reverse and the Hangman in reverse. Okay, so the King of Pentacles is going back to something. Huh, this is crazy, Libra. You got a lot of shit going on. The Sun card. This person is miserable without you. You make them happy. They want a new beginning with you, something fiery. I think you have more than one person, the devil. The emperor is the person, This the fire sign, the emperor, could be Aries, okay? This person is a toxic person that, you're, that you are releasing, you're walking away from. Person doesn't want to walk away from you. The king of swords, this air energy. This person could be somebody from your past that's coming back to you. That did a lot of thinking, and now they want to come back. Show me the Four of Swords. Show me the Four of Swords. Who's healing? The Ten of Pentacles. So somebody wants something stable and secure, and they're waiting it out right now. Show me the Seven of Cups. Somebody has a lot of choices and options. Jesus. Oh, my God. These cards are like insane. Hold on, y'all. The energies are crazy. Yeah, somebody definitely... You definitely... This is more than one person coming up in your energy. This is not the same person. Um, Because there's too many different... Too much shit going on for it to be one person. Too many different energies. So you definitely deal with more than one person. Somebody does not want to walk away from you. It could be a fire sign. Hold on, y'all. It could be a fire sign that does not want to walk away from you. Um, that you were dealing with. Somebody from your past six of cups. There's a king of swords here, though, that wants to come in. Okay. Show me that seven of cups, please. These cards are like slurred in the energy. Show me the seven of cups. Knight of Wands in reverse. King of Pentacles in reverse. Hmm. This person's trying to decide what they want to do, but I don't know if this person is stable or not. Again, Ten of Swords in reverse. 
this is something that was dead. This is something that was dead, dead, dead. That's coming back. Somebody trying to decide. Hmm. Temperance. There we go again. About healing. The Sagittarius energy. High Priestess. Knight of Pentacles. Okay. So to sum this up, Libra. You got a lot of shit going on. I need to smoke during this reading. You walked away from you walked away from somebody. Okay? Somebody that had a, that offered you a cup of love. Could be Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You do not want them. It was justice. You felt like it was the wrong, it was the right thing to do. Eight of Pentacles, as you working on yourself, working hard, putting a lot of effort into something. Six of Cups, that's somebody from your past. Having thinking about somebody from your past, more from your past, nostalgia. Um, things like that could also be family. You know, maybe you reach out to family, family helping you at this time of if need or in this moment. The page of wands in reverse is you being inspired, knowing that there's something within you, a change that has to be made, but you're not making it. Ten of wands is you like releasing a burden, a cycle being complete. Okay. The seven of wands with the hierophant in reverse. That could be you standing your guard, protecting yourself, not really wanting to jump into anything quickly. The hierophant in reverse could mean um uh, breaking societal norms could mean a, a broken commitment. Okay. The world in reverse is not being complete. Lack of closure about something. All right. The nine of wands is you standing your guard. Okay. You being guarded, you being the, um, a wounded warrior, but still standing up for the fight. Okay. Whoever this knight of swords is, this is somebody that this could have been a broken engagement, broken relationship with. Okay. Um, or somebody that you're not coming together with right now. Okay. And then the king of swords, Got the Six of Swords reversed. So this is somebody going back to something from the past. Something that was maybe toxic or bad. Seven of Wands, giving up, letting your guard down. The Hangman, again, thought about it enough, ready to come back, okay? The Ace of Wands, all right? That's something new. Somebody, this person wanting something new with you, all right? This King of Pentacles, I mean, this Emperor in reverse. This is more Aries energy or fire sign, Okay? But the emperor is Aries, okay? This person made you very unhappy and this person was very toxic. You had to walk away, all right? Four of Swords, that's this person meditating, healing over there, okay? Ten of Pentacles, doing what they want, though. They want something solid, stable, with money, secure, okay? And Nine of Cups is you making them happy. They feel like you are their wish fulfillment, all right? And the Seven of Cups is this person having a lot of options, a lot of choices. This person is in and out, though, the, as being the Knight of Wands in reverse, King of Pentacles in reverse, somebody not grounded, Ten of Swords, things were ended, um, ended on a bad note, but this person is trying to revive it. Okay, Libra? So I hope this helped you guys some. If it did resonate, don't forget to leave me a comment. Let me know how it resonated, and don't forget to like the video. Toodles!